MIDI Captain Super Mode Key Settings 2. This video will introduce the types and formats of MIDI commands, as well as key configuration points. Program Change, abbreviated as PC Command. Continuous Change, abbreviated as CC Command. Note, abbreviated as NT Command. Let's briefly introduce the format characteristics and functions of these three MIDI commands. In the PC Command, CC Command, NT command, the first parenthesis is MIDI channel range is 1 to 16. The essence of the PC command is a number between 0 and 127. Almost all professional audio equipment, including keyboard synthesizers, guitar multi-effects processors, hardware sound source devices, and even some guitar amplifiers, supports receiving MIDI PC commands. This allows the device to jump to the corresponding patch number within its preset patch list. For example, sending the command PC5 will set the patch to number 5. The CC command has one more parameter than the PC command. It usually consists of two numbers ranging from 0 to 127. The first number, referred to as CC number, typically serves as an ID for the function and needs to correspond with or map to the controlled function on the host device. Many host devices support so-called MIDI command learning, an automatic mapping method. The second parameter of the CC command is used to control the specific parameter value of the corresponding function. It can be a continuously changing parameter with a range of 0 to 127 or a state parameter, such as the switch state of an effect submodule. Usually, any number from 0 to 63 represents off, and any number from 64 to 127 represents on. Of course, there are also cases where 0 represents off and other non-zero values represent on. This depends on the function design of the host device itself and needs to be referred to in the manual of the controlled host. For example, According to the MIDI section of the manual of the Kemper Profiler Player Guitar Multi-Effect Processor, we can find that CC1, usually also written as number 1, corresponds to the depth of the wah pedal. The command CC1, 127, can simulate the wah pedal being pressed to the maximum position, and CC1, 0, can minimize the wah effect. CC68 can be used to control the DLY delay module switch. Sending CC68, 0, can turn off the delay module, while CC68, 127, can turn on the delay module. Next, let's look at the third type of MIDI command, note or NT command. It is actually exactly the same as the sound control of our keyboard synthesizer. It also has two parameters. The first parameter is the name of the note itself, which can be found in the table below, and the second parameter is the intensity or loudness of the sound. When using NT commands, it should be noted that some hosts or sound effect modules do not have a natural attenuation function when controlling sound. When we configure a note to sound, we must use a loudness value of zero to turn off the sound when the sound needs to end, otherwise, the sound may continue to be emitted and will not stop. By configuring the simultaneous sending of multiple NT commands, we can achieve the function of sending chords with one key. Many audio software programs use note commands to map different drum kits, so note commands can also be used to trigger drum rhythms. 